In this episode of DPV, we're changing out the starter on my boat. found yourself paddling your boat across the lake because it won't start? I have and uh, that's why I'm going to show you how to replace a starter on a 4.3 OMC inboard outboard motor. So here it is in all its glory. It's, I think it's going to be a pretty simple job. First thing you want to do, I always want to disconnect the battery when you are working on the starter because there's a hot lead on the starter and uh, you don't want to get zapped, so um, this one is always hot. So you want to make sure that you disconnect the battery so you don't zap yourself. Ugh. Looks like I'm going to need some help. Oh, here we go. It's gonna be hard to show you how to get this thing unbolted, but basically there's just two bolts. I'll go uh, get a shot of the new starter so you can see where they're at. But basically, I'm gonna be laying right there and reaching my hand under there with a wrench and undo it. First, let's take those wires off. All right, wires are all disconnected. So you do wanna remember like where they go, so I know that this little blue wire here that was on the outside and the brown wire whatever color that is it's on the inside so there's three tabs in there and then you got your power wire that goes to the middle Here's the new starter. It is a lot smaller, which will make it easier to go in. Bolt pattern appears to be the same. Looks like the depth is the same. So maybe new technology, I don't know. Anyway, I bought this thing on Amazon. I will make sure I link it down below. Um, it was like 75 or 80 bucks. Hopefully it's okay, it's that small. Um, those two bolts, they just go vertical up into the block in the bottom, so it's not too bad. 916's head. And then this is where the wiring goes. This is uh, where the hot lead goes, and then purple wire, brown wire on my boat. I don't know what color it's going to be on yours. Uh, one of those is like the exciter. Um, I don't know which one, but... That's why you just got to pay attention when you're taking it off. Make sure you get them in the right spot going back in. But uh, pretty easy. So bolt this thing in. Hook the water up and see if, uh, if it works. All right, got the water all hooked up. You don't want to start your boat out of the water without one of these. So I'll link, what, link it in the description below if you don't have one. There's like pumps and stuff that need water. Also, totally left the key on, so I had to charge it. It's all shiny in there. Look at that. Oh, 
Well, the starter definitely works, but I probably need to run a can of seafoam through this thing. And uh, yeah, I'm out of juice already. The battery hasn't been on the charger very long, and it was completely dead. It wouldn't even, you know, raise up the prop or whatever. So anyway, that's how you swap out a starter. A 4.3 OMC. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below. If you have any suggestions, leave them in the comments below. Um, yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. Wheel it, wreck it, wrench it, repeat. We'll see you next time.